I'm Julia Sondu, showing you where development is happening. Please come and join us. China and Russia building new two giant nuclear power plants in Africa. Starting from Uganda, Uganda plans to start nuclear power generation by 2031 minister. Uganda said on Thursday it expects to start generating at least 1,000 megawatts MW, from nuclear power by 2031 as it moves to diversify its sources of electricity and accelerate its energy transition, a key part of its climate change response. Uganda has uranium deposits and President Yoweri Museveni has said his government was keen to exploit them for potential nuclear energy development. The East African country has signed a deal with China under which the China National Nuclear Corporation CNNC, would help Uganda build capacity in the use of atomic energy for peaceful purposes. The first nuclear project, Bayende Nuclear Power Plant, would be located at Bayende, about 150 kilometers 93 miles north of the capital Kampala, Energy and Minerals Minister Ruth Nankaburwa Sentamu said in a statement. Preparation to evaluate the Bayende nuclear power plant site is ongoing to pave the way for the first nuclear power project expected to generate 2,000 megawatts, with the first 1,000 megawatts to be connected to the national grid by 2031, she said. Uganda is making firm steps to integrate nuclear energy into the electricity generation mix to ensure energy security and provide sufficient electricity for industrialization, while Russia's state-owned energy corporation Rosatom last year started construction of Egypt's first nuclear plant. Uganda has an installed generating capacity of about 1,500 megawatts but officials say they expect the country's energy needs to jump in coming years as earnings from oil exports fuel an economic boom. The next is El Dabar nuclear power plant. The El Dabar NPP will be the largest project of Russian-Egyptian cooperation after the Aswan High Dam. El Dabar nuclear power plant, NPP, Egypt's first nuclear power project, is under construction in the Metro Governorate on the Mediterranean coast, 250 kilometers west of Alexandria. The Russian State Atomic Energy Corporation, ROSATOM, is the developer of the $30 billion nuclear power plant, which will be owned and operated by the Nuclear Power Plant Authority NPPA, of the Arab Republic of Egypt. El Dabar is Rosatom's first major nuclear power project in Africa. It will comprise four pressurized water reactors PWRs, with a total capacity of 4.8 gigawatts, which is expected to account for up to 50% of Egypt's power generation capacity. Rosatom started construction of Units 1 and 2, followed by the pouring of the first concrete for Unit 3 in May 2023. The commissioning of the first unit is expected to begin in 2026 and the plant will be operating at full capacity with all four units by 2030. The project is expected to boost the country's economy and industrial development by creating up to 50,000 jobs. El Dabar Nuclear Power Project Background the El Dabar nuclear power project is part of Egypt's nuclear program. El Dabar nuclear power plant location and details. The El Dabar nuclear power plant site is in close proximity to rail, road and transmission interconnections. It has low regional seismic activity and sufficient cooling water supply. The plant will consist of four VVER-1200 nuclear reactors of AES-2206 design which are capable of producing 1.2 gigawatts each. The first unit is expected to begin commercial operations in 2026 while commissioning of the remaining three reactors is scheduled for 2029. The VVER-1200 reactor is a third-generation pressurized water reactor that is fully compliant with all international safety and post-Fukushima IAEA requirements. It is designed to withstand the crash of a 400T airplane or earthquakes up to an intensity of 9 on the Richter scale. The design lifetime of the plant will be 60 years. Financing of El Dabar nuclear power plant. Russia will fund approximately 85% of the construction cost of the El Dabar nuclear power project. It will provide a $25 billion loan under a financing agreement signed between the Ministry of Finance of Egypt and the Ministry of Finance of the Russian Federation. 
the loan is repayable over a period of 22 years at an interest rate of 3% a year. The remaining 15% will be raised by Egypt from private investors. Contractors involved. The Ministry of Electricity and Renewable Energy of Egypt signed an agreement with Russian state-owned company ROSATOM to build, finance and operate the nuclear plant. The contract also includes a supply of nuclear fuel over the plant's entire operational life and assistance for the operation and maintenance of the plant for the initial 10 years of operation. ROSATOM will also build storage and supply containers for storing spent fuel. Gowling WLG has acted as the legal advisor in the negotiation of the contract. The contracts included engineering, procurement and construction, spent nuclear fuel, nuclear fuel supply and operations support and maintenance. ROSATOM Engineering Division is the general designer and contractor for the project. Worley, a professional services company based in Australia, provided consultancy services for the project. Bulgarian engineering company GCR assisted Worley in reviewing licensing and technical documentation including the preliminary and probabilistic safety analysis reports for the project. Rosatom also known as Rosatom State Nuclear Energy Corporation, the State Atomic Energy Corporation Rosatom, or Rosatom State Corporation, is a Russian state corporation headquartered in Moscow that specializes in nuclear energy, nuclear non-energy goods and high-tech products. Established in 2007, the non-profit organization comprises more than 350 enterprises, including scientific research organizations, a nuclear weapons complex, and the world's only nuclear icebreaker fleet. The organization is the largest electricity generating company in Russia, producing 215.746 terawatt hours of electricity, 20.28% of the country's total electricity production. The corporation ranks first in overseas NPP construction, responsible for 76% of global nuclear technology exports, 35 nuclear power plant units, at different stages of development, in 12 countries, as of December 2020. 5. Rosatom also manufactures equipment, produces isotopes for nuclear medicine, carries out research, and conducts material studies. It also produces supercomputers and software as well as different nuclear and non-nuclear products. Rosatom plans to further develop renewable energy and wind power. Two nuclear power plants are being built in Russia at Kursk 2 NPP with plans announced for two more units at Kola NPP. Rosatom has a 38% world market share and in 2019 led in global uranium enrichment services, 36%, and covers 16% of the global nuclear fuel market. This is the end of our program today. See you on Intervlog same time tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Thank you for watching Intervlog. Thank you.